Detective Nathan McNeil. Well, I'll be damned. Gabe Weller. When I requested help from the Ishimura, I didn't realize they had you on board. Transferred six months ago. It's been a long time, Nate. It's good to see you. You know, it's been hell down here. Some extra hands will come in useful. Sorry, no cop duty. We have an errand. An errand? Gabe, we've got assaults, murder, suicides, almost 60 dead and dozens injured. Nobody here has ever seen anything like it. We just can't cope. Cope? Wasn't it you who pulled me out of a three-way firefight on Scorpio 6 and then went back in to plant limpets? And now some crazy miners have got you losing sleep? It's not that simple. So what is this errand anyway? Baines! Hutchins! Hey. You too, rookie. We need to get to the morgue. Think you can cope with giving us direction? I'll take you. I have to drop this off at evidence anyhow. What do you want with the morgue? The captain sent us to retrieve the bodies from the Union Square suicide before they pop the cork on the planet. But keep it quiet, okay? Oh, sure. Your crew is really inconspicuous. You gonna introduce us? Baines and Hutchins, two of my best. Detective. A pleasure. And Carklin's here as my rookie. It's an honor, sir. Sergeant Weller speaks highly of you. <laughs> Jeez. Don't let him fill your head with his macho tales, son. Baines, Hutchins, go prep the shuttle and wait for us. Yes, sir. All right. Follow me. So you're the rookie, huh? Must be why you got the shitty transport job. Actually, I'm here because Sergeant Weller doesn't want to handle corpses. I guess some things never change. Lop it up, partner. McCabe to McNeil. Nate, you there? McNeil here. What's up? Multiple assault in the mess hall in your sector. Sounds like a riot down there. Are you up? Not right now. Higgins should be good for it, though. All right, thanks. McCabe out. I told you things were crazy down here. You sure this is the right more? We only have one. I was here just yesterday. It was a full house. Not anymore. I'll need to see a manifest. The captain won't like this. Sir, there's a tow tag here. Abbott D. Ring any bells, McNeil? That's the crazy son of a bitch who led the mass suicide. Hold on. I'll pull him up. He's on file, but there's no record of a transfer. He should be right here. You? What are you doing here? Get out! Doc, you all right? Holy oh, shit, he's lost it! Help! I got your back! He's down. What do you reckon? You stashed the body somewhere? Maybe. Let's go check. Is that normal? Not really, no. Hold on, I've got a glow worm. Shit. Whatever it was must have knocked out the elevator too. Great. No lights, no elevators, no bodies. And the colony full of crazy. Sir, what's going on? Keep it together, Private. Sergeant Weller to Ishimura. Come in, Ishimura. 
Damn it! We can get up through the medical hall instead. Let's go. That look in his eyes reminded me of a kid that went crazy last week. Just an engineer, but something in him snapped. You mean like these guys? Yeah, kind of. <laughs> going on up there another riot it's calling to us to death and, and on. what did you say uh sorry nothing sir this is the only way through be ready for anything Kirklands. shut up i'm trying to think p -Sec, what's going on here stay out of this cop it's none of your business just tell me what the problem is, son. You don't want to hurt anyone, do you? No. No, you, you're trying to trick me. I can feel my head's gonna burst. I'll get one of the docs to look at it, okay? Just walk to me. Nice and easy. That's better. Now take it easy. No! Get out of my head! Don't take another step. Sick. Head through the lobby and then turn off the plaza. I'll stay here and deal with these guys. Do you want me to stay and help, sir? No. Come on, rookie. See you back at your office, McNeil. Shit! Not you two! Back off! All of you! <laughs> I have to warn Weller and Carkland. out there come out identify yourself <laughs> <laughs> Take another step.
Jesus. The whole colony's gone to hell. Am I glad to see you? Was it like this when you got here? Worse. Let's a fight our way through. Sounds like your rookie's losing it. Yeah. Reckon whatever's gone to everyone else down here is getting to him too. Shouldn't you take his firearm? <laughs> if he cracks, I'll deal with it. The day I can't put down a rookie is the day I hang up my boots. <laughs> Thanks for the help, Weller. Your rookie lost his mind and tried to kill me. Sucker punch. Can't believe Cockins did that. Neither of us is getting any younger. Shit! Where did these guys come from? The hell with us again, Zakisa. We can barricade ourselves in. Sounds like a damn good idea to me. They're still coming. Hurry up. I can't hold this door forever, McNeil. It's done. They won't get through that. Then let's get to your office so I can call the issue more. See if Chief Vincent's got the answers. Gunfire. Where's it coming from? Upstairs, I think. Shit. Maybe somebody got inside before us. But we just locked ourselves in. Whatever it is, it's our problem now. Officers, listen up. Body shots don't put these things down. Aim for the limbs, take out the joints to immobilize them. What things? What are you talking about? Don't know. He can't mean the colonists. Is there something else in here? Either that, or he's flipped like everyone else around here. Jesus. So aliens do exist. And they're trying to kill us. Isn't life dandy?
Thanks for the help. Who the hell are you? Easy, Weller. She's not p -Sec. I'm McNeil. What's your name? Lexine. Lexine Murdoch. Well, Lexine. You're a lucky girl. Lucky? My boyfriend was killed last week. My father's gone missing, and now this? Wait a second. I recognize you. You're Sam Caldwell's emergency contact. Sam was my boyfriend. Listen, I'm sorry about what happened. What are you doing here? My father's missing. He disappeared at the same time all those unitologists killed themselves. I came to see if there was any news, but then those... things came in and started killing everyone. What's happening? I'm not sure. But it's not good for anyone. Ishimura! The colony is under attack from unknown hostiles! Come in, goddammit! Orbital comms must have gone down with the rest of the electrics. We're on our own. Wait. You're from the ship? Yes. Special Security Task Force. Then why don't we just go there? You must have a shuttle, right? She's right. Baines and Hutchins will be waiting for us. Come on, McNeil. Wait. What about me? Go home, lock yourself up, and sit tight. Home? Are you crazy? I've lost everyone. Sorry, sweetheart, but you can't you know, come with us. You know, pretty decimated. We can't handle another missing persons case. What are you talking about? Which is why you should come with us. Right, Sergeant? She's your responsibility. Fine. Let's go. Are you from the ship too? No. I'm a PSEC detective. Nate McNeil. Well, thank you, Nate McNeil. Just doing my job. Enough firepower, Weller. Enough! No such thing. Oh my god. No way they did this to each other. They probably thought they'd be safe inside Pisek. And we kept them out. They were trying to kill us. Remember that. Kinda quiet all of a sudden. I feel like I'm being watched. Because we probably are. Keep it tight. Oh, 
God. They're not aliens. They're people. Were people. Whatever they are now, it isn't human. Let's just get to the shuttle. Mission Square. Let's go. What do you make of that? Somebody was trying to keep the bad guys out. We'll have to clear it. Incoming! Keep going! I'll hold them off! We don't need to rebuild the barricade. And I thought I was the optimist here. Mission Square's right up ahead. We should keep moving. I remember this area. The shuttle base just off the square, right? That's right. Good. Baines, Hutchins, give me a sit rep. In the shuttle and standing by, Sarge. It's bloody chaos down here, though. I had to break a few noses to stop people piling in with us. Everyone's looking for a way out. Look! There's one taking off now! There's a sight for sore eyes. Wait. Something's wrong. She's gonna crash! Get down! <laughs> No. Look at them. All those people. Dead. Every shuttle in the bay. Destroyed. Damn it! Bains and Hutchins were in there. God damn this fucking place! Man, what's your name? <coughs> Warren. <coughs> Warren Eckhart, Executive Director of Colonial Mining Operations. Quite a mouthful. You're lucky to even be alive after that. The shuttles! They're all gone. We're stuck here. Not necessarily. There's a surveying shuttle in the Sector 8 maintenance bay. Are you sure? Quite sure. I itched a ride on it yesterday from the Ishimura. You're from the ship? What are you doing here? CEC business. And none of yours, Sergeant. Who cares? Let's just find the shuttle and go. For all we know, those things are all across the colony. Are you ready to fight your way through them? We may not have to. Megavent 12 runs underneath the colony, and I'm sure there's an exit into the maintenance bay. So how do we get into this... Megavent? There's an equipment lift ahead. It should take us straight down. Then what are we waiting for? We can't get in! Damn! McNeil, clear that debris!
Reja, what's wrong? Why is it stopped? The power's done. There must be a broken connection. I'll fix it. Thank you. 